Secret Beach, one of Rio de Janeiro's most prestigious sites. A lagoon in the city shielded from the wild sea by rocks. But it can also be dangerous to reach and people have even died trying. This is how to find Praia do Secreto. <laughs> Yes, my friends, we're still in the very west end of Rio de Janeiro, home of the city's best beaches. Alright, welcome to part two of this crazy series of posting one video for every day of the week from Rio de Janeiro. And today I'll be showing one of the true benefits of choosing to move outside of the tourist zones. We're currently in a place known as Recreo, about one hour outside of Copacabana. One of many parts of the city where tourists rarely step foot, even though it costs less than $10 with an Uber. Because as you might know, Rio is loaded with beaches, and to reach the very best ones, you gotta get out of town. Not only is life less hectic, the western part of Rio is generally safer, and its main area, Barra da Tijuca, has the best nightclubs in town. And as a twist of fate, my apartment happens to be just 10 minutes away from the mysterious Praia do Secreto, Secret Beach. According to rumor, it's hiding somewhere around here. It's a place a lot of people like to mention, but few have visited. And meeting up with a local guide also on the way to the mysterious Secret Beach. Primera... <laughs> Praia do Secreto. Primera vez para você? Um, mais ou menos. Kind of. Kind of. Yeah, I'll I, let me guess. You were there, but the water was too high. Exactly. Yeah. Actually, the, the, the very first time that I came here, it was too high. And then I have to swim just to get in the, in the real pool. Yeah, because the waving was so strong and the, and the, the tide was high as well. Yeah, because this is the thing with Praia do Secreto. It usually doesn't exist because it's under the water. Crossing fingers that it will be showing itself today. I actually haven't googled this beach because I want it to be a surprise. I have no idea what it looks like. Alright, so what's so good with this place? What's so good with Praia do Secreto? It's more tranquil, you know, with a protected um, rock or wall, which is actually really good. That sounds exactly like what we're after. My information said the best way to reach it was by walking from the west end end of Macumba Beach. <sighs> So a little hot today, isn't it? It's too hot, it's actually boiling hot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's not kidding, it's almost 40 degrees today, which is not ideal for this adventure. So, uh, where is the beach? How do we get there? So we will have to swim. Swim? Yeah. Oopsie, yeah. If the tide is not very low, the path leading there will be underwater. The pool is over there. But we need to go this way, which is actually flooded. That is not good. Not sure about you, but for me, it doesn't look entirely safe getting there. So, would you say the water is high or low at the moment? Uh, high, high, because normally the water, the water just goes until, until the rocks. And this space is, is dry. Ah. But right now, if you look at this. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. So, you're saying the idea is to swim along the coastline until we reach that secluded little lagoon over there. I mean, even if we actually survive that adventure, my phone and drone will for sure not. So yeah. to get there, we need to, probably, probably we can just walk. Walk on the water, like Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I think I've sinned too much in my life to do that. I'm sorry to say this, but <laughs> you're gonna have to do this walk on your own, man. <laughs> um, I'm not sure either, actually. I want to, but... Uh, it looks really worthy, to be honest. I mean, as long as you can't fly or get some divine help, uh, this is not gonna work. Uh, it seems we have to get back a little later for that one, eh? I'm starting to realize why so few people have actually visited Praia do Secreto. Don't worry, we'll get there. But first, it's seriously time for some breakfast <laughs> and something to drink. If this will be the last breakfast of my life, at least I'll have a decent view. The local carioca's choice when you need to replenish fast. Guaravita. 
a little like iced tea. I will not give up on that Praia do Secreto, but perhaps go home and leave the drone and change to a cheaper phone. And priority number one while preparing for an adventure, have a little something for those nerves. Oh, obrigado! Caipirinha! Wow, this has got to be one of my best caipirinhas in Rio. Remarkable. And then things got weird. All right, we have some confusion here. <laughs> There's actually the guys staying here. They're saying we're now currently at Praia do Secreto. Is this right? Where are we? Is this Secreto? Yes. Secret. 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 Uh, onde, Secret. Co onde começa a Praia do Secreto? E, uh... A Praia do Secreto começa aqui. Okay. E aí na próxima pedra, lá embaixo, já é a Praia da Macumba. So, Macumba começa lá. Aqui. Uh -huh. I feel... Uh, so I've been on Praia do Secreto this whole time. Estamos agora, agora em Praia no do Praia do Secreto. Sim, essa vista é linda. Wow! <laughs> so I guess this video is done now. I'm not sure how to feel about this. We did it! We did it! We did it! <laughs> yes! Hey, journalism rule number one. Always check your facts. Desculpe, amigos. Oi. É, em qual praia estamos agora? É. Praia do Pontal. Requeiro dos Bandeirantes. Requeiro dos Bandeirantes. É. Praia do Pontal. E onde está a praia Macumba? Aqui. Ma é aqui. Aqui também? Isso. Então, onde está a Praia do Secreto? E ó, aí é pra lá. É, tem, tem, tem que subir, tem que, tem que subir aquele subir. ali. Tem uma, tem uma estrada. Subir, você vai subir aqui a... a... Certo. Ok. Let's give it another go then. Thank you. Thank you. Never have I experienced such confusion among locals when it comes to which beach is which. <laughs> so, not only is the beach back there where we thought it was, it turns out there's also another way to reach it. So, what we gotta do is taking a little detour around the beach, entering it through a secret path on the freeway. However, this way to reach Praia do Secreto is described as the dangerous way. <laughs> but I mean, it can't get worse than the alternative. Let's do this. It is not recommended taking this path if you're not in a decent physical shape. It requires steady balance and some climbing. And there it is. And it's not really a beach at all. <laughs> oh yes! We finally found it! Now the only problem is uh, getting down there. Well, you get down one way or another. This might be dangerous. Remember, tilt your body weight back against the cliff. I'm just gonna have to crawl a little. This was actually not as hard as I thought it would be, but perhaps not recommended doing this on a rainy day. Ladies and gentlemen, we did it. Oh God, I cannot describe how satisfying this feels. The real name for this place is currently Piscina do Secreto, the secret pool. So, where is Praia do Secreto then? <laughs> it's the same place, when the tide is low enough to reveal the sand underneath. You gotta love all this confusion, right? At least we're here. I think we have deserved ourselves a swim. Let's do this! Agora está filmando. Ah, Frida! Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> I was at a point of no retreat there. If I didn't get into this lagoon, <laughs> I would have passed out. Yeah, I'd like to remind it's still 40 degrees warm today. And climbing those dark rocks a day like this, they get burning hot. Lugar maravilloso, né? 
Janeiro. Opa! Não é sua primeira vez aqui, né? Não, eu moro aqui no, Rio de Janeiro, aqui no Recreio, eu tô sempre aqui. É um pouco perigoso? Sim, dependendo da, da maré, é um pouco perigoso. Hoje a maré tá cheia, mas tá calmo, o mar. Às vezes eu venho, olho lá de cima, aqui pra baixo não tá bom, nem desse. Easily one of my best swims in Rio de Janeiro. The water here is so much warmer than in the ocean outside. It's so still and <laughs> you kind of feel a little proud once you're actually getting inside here. I'm so happy we weren't stupid enough to try that other way over here. Yeah guys, if you're fit enough to do this, don't miss visiting this lagoon, secret beach, whatever it's called. It's so worth the effort. And now to the minor logistical problem, getting out of this little pool with cell phone. <laughs> I can tell you this much, for a moment there, this material was almost lost forever. And I think we still got time enough for another beach visit. When you're this close, it's a shame not visiting Barra da Tijuca. It's time to meet up with Sam again. By now, this place shouldn't need any further introduction. But yeah, it's the best part of Western Rio. Ah, I have missed Barra da Tijuca. No doubt, one of my favorite beaches in Rio. Only question, where is Sam? Huh, of course, there he is. A little rascal working out if I'm gonna film him. Looking fit? Feeling fit. Does this mean I have to do a few pull-ups as well? I think that's exactly what it means. It's good. Yeah, I should be doing this a little more often. I don't love this particular part of my day. Ah, almost 80. 90. 99. 99. Okay, stop this nonsense. I want to tell you something. Ever since I hosted a few gringo tours back in the days, people have asked me to do more. <laughs> now it's happening. During Carnival, me and Sam will host a five-day-long intensive program, Rio Rampage, where you will learn to develop your social skills while having the time of your life. Let's go! I dare to say this will be the best carnival you had. So, who's Sam? He's British and a professional dating coach. Clear goals equal success in a given discipline. He's also been living in Rio for years, helping awkward foreigners to talk to Brazilian girls. And now he's gonna do the same for us. Personal coaching, wild carnival fun, and private house party. <laughs> this will be crazy. Now back to Baja. Oh yes. Ho ho ho. Ah, o rei de capirinha. Cheers, bro. And Sam, he loves Brazil so much, he even has a Brazilian wife and family here. What's so freaking good about Brazil? Brazil gives you confidence. Brazil is free confidence. You arrive here, there is no way you can walk down any street in Rio de Janeiro and not be talking to someone. This place is a place where you can live the good life. You can make friends easily. You can have a child and you can still be on the beach drinking caipirinhas and talking to new people. You are gonna be forced out of that introspective, introverted mindset and you're gonna be forced into confidence every time you walk down the street. Sam, eloquent as usual. Run! Run to the sea! But I'd like to add one thing. Coming to Brazil, you're gonna have a whole lot of fun. For me, it's all about the good vibes, and weather, and beaches, and people, and caipirinha. So, I guess that has got to be our little unexpected end of this video. See you tomorrow, when I'm hopefully within the city gates of Rio de Janeiro again. Take care. If you like this video, please subscribe and support the channel. Thanks for watching and be safe.